Welcome back guys. So this is section 5.3 and today we are going to solve question 21 of it. So the statement is the implementation of a logic circuit in figure 5.58. Okay, so this is the figure 5.58 using only NAND gates. Okay, so previously we have seen that we can implement the plenty of the fundamental circuits by using the NAND gates. Okay, here we are given a NAND gate and here we have to implement it by using the NAND gates. Okay, so this is a fundamental circuit logical circuit and we have to implement it by using the NAND gates okay so what will be the, the strategy here okay so first of all what we have to do initially we will have the logic circuit okay from this logic circuit what we have to do we have to find the logic expression okay and from this logic expression we will have to implement it by using the NAND gate okay so it would be our strategy here okay so let me first uh, find the logic expression from it so this is the uh, logic circuit which I have and from it let me find the logic expression okay so to find the logic expression let me use this color so here we have the first gate so this is a NAND gate here so in order to find the output of it it will be a b whole complement here at this point and here we will have word these two inputs b and c are applied here and here we have a north gate here so b plus c whole complement will be the output here okay so here to this gate both of these are applied and at the output of it what we will get here we will get a b complement dot b plus c whole complement and the whole complement of it as well okay so this is the output of this circuit similarly uh, this is now applied here okay to this uh, nor gate and to this this c is also applied so here what we will get to out the output of it this will be x and here we will get a a b whole complement okay dot b plus c whole complement and the complement here as well okay and also the c here with which I have to use this whole complement as well and this is because of what this is because of this NOR gate okay so we can also simplify it by using the De Morgan's law okay so let me use the De Morgan's law here as well in order to simplify it so according to the De Morgan's law these two will be separated out okay so what will happen we will get a b complement dot b plus c whole complement and the complement of it is here while here it will be c complement while the sign you can see that has been changed to multiplication while this complement has been divided over both of them okay so this is the let me use another okay so this is another complement here so these two complements let me use this red color these two complements will cancel each other and here what we will get at the output of it here we will get a b whole complement dot b plus c complement dot c complement okay or we can also write it like a b c complement dot b plus c whole complement okay so this is the answer of this uh, circuit that we have the logic expression and this logic expression has been given in the form which is given here okay so now what we have to do we have to implement it by using the NAND gate okay so we have a logic expression here and now we have to implement it by using the NAND gate okay so let me move down somehow okay so now let me move down so here 
let me see that how many inputs do i have so i can see that i have a b c three inputs so let me use them here a b c okay so the three inputs are one two three okay so as i have to use the nand gate so therefore uh, i have to implement this one first okay so this one first then this one first and i have to multiply them together by using this sign so here first of all this circuit will be what in order to implement it what i have to do i have to use the nand gate okay so nand gate is here and here the three input nand gate should be used so here this first this second while this third and here we will get what a b c whole complement okay after it what i have to do i have to find the b plus c whole complement and in order to find this nor gate from this uh, uh, nand gates what i have to do i have to use the two nor gate two nand gates okay the two inputs nor gates in which the two inputs are combined together okay and here then these two are given to another NAND gate okay here this is another NAND gate and it will give me what it will give me the output which will be the OR gate so in order to take the NOR gate out of it what I will do I will apply it to another NAND gate as well with these two inputs combined together okay so here we have b plus c so let me use this b here and c here and at the output of it what i will get i will get here b plus c whole complement okay so these are the two inputs which we have here and these are okay we can see that this is one this is two and these now have to be multiplied together by using this multiplication sign and for it i can use this nand gate okay two input nand gates so first here the input is here the second one is here while at the output of it what i will get i will get here the a b c whole complement dot b plus c whole complement with the whole complement over it okay so in order to remove this whole complement what i have to do i have to use another nand gate to which this input is applied and at the output of it what i will get this complement will be removed because this is an inverter and at the output of it what i will get i will get a b c whole complement dot b plus c whole complement as well so this is the output and therefore this is the output which we have found from here and this is the circuit uh, which is basically the implementation of the logic expression by using the NAND gates okay we can see that here we have those these NAND gates and these are the important gates which we have implemented here okay so uh, that's enough for today and which we have seen the fundamental steps of converting any logic circuit to their um, NAND gates counterpart so in the next question we will talk about some other questions in which we will have to implement the same circuit by using the NOR gates okay so the steps will remain the same because we have found the logic circuit or logic expression from this logic circuit and then the only step will remain there would be the implementation of it by using the NOR gate okay so I think it's enough for today and I will see you with some more interesting questions in our upcoming video till then take care of yourself and I will see you soon.